بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أحبت في الله remembering Allah سبحانه وتعالى is a way of bringing life to your heart or it is a means to bringing life to your heart and in fact it is life of the heart meaning the heart that is absent of the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala meaning it has no remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in fact is a dead heart spiritually it's a dead heart the Prophet ﷺ said, "Inna fi jizid mudgha, ida salaha salaha jizid kullu, ida fasa da fasa da jizid kullu ul ala wahi al." The Prophet ﷺ said, "Verily, in the heart is a morsel of flesh. If it is healthy, the whole heart is he- the whole body is healthy. If it is sick, the whole body is sick. Verily, it's the heart." Sheikh Islam ibn Taymiyyah said, in "Rahmatullahi alayhi rahmatun wasiya," in a beautiful statement regarding this issue of the heart, making a similitude here. He said, Remembrance of Allah the Exalted for the heart is similar to water for the fish. What would be the condition of the fish if it left the water? So understand, Ahabat Tafillah, we know without a doubt that if I go and find a trout in this water or a salmon and I bring it out for a time, he will die. Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created him or created the fish to live and dwell in the sea. Likewise, if your heart does not have the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, your heart becomes dead. Look at the many examples and I'm not even talking about the disbelievers, that's, that's min bab al-awla. But I'm talking about those people who are Muslim, who you see never remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is so easy for them to s- indulge in sin. Not indulge in sin only, immerse in sin, as if you immerse yourself into the water. They delve into sin. They swim in the sin and they drown in the sin. So it shows, and that those are the signs of a dead heart. Those are the signs of someone who does not remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And may Allah tabarak wa ta'ala bless us with ikhlas, with abat, and to be of those who remember him often. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad.